was so hot, like I probably would have, I mean, I probably would have had to get out of the car. So I totally understand, you know, their concern for the dog or whatever. I get that. A North Ridgeville woman is talking exclusively to News 5 tonight as she's feeling the heat for leaving her young dog in her parked car in 80 degree weather. And this is video of the dog's dramatic rescue. It's been shared on Facebook hundreds of times. And tonight police have issued an arrest warrant for 20 year old Kenzie Boyles telling her she'll be sent to jail. Well now she's explaining why she did it only to News 5 investigator Joe Paganakis. Well, the whole thing happened here at the Burger King on Cleveland Street in the city of Elyria. Kenzie Boyle's car parked right here. Her dog locked inside, found by a Burger King employee with temperatures approaching 80 degrees. The whole thing captured by TMC News. Police say the four-month-old dog was panting heavily and showed signs of distress. Locked in the car as witnesses tried to give the dog water with a straw through a small crack in the passenger side window. And I'm seeing this dog, so I started looking inside the car and all that. There's nothing in there, like they don't have any food or water. It was Burger King employee Antonio Arroyo who discovered the dog in the parking lot at high noon and called police. Yeah, the cops came and then a towing company came because me and the cop, the cop was trying to get the door handle open. Everyone doing all they can to get the car unlocked, wondering if they would be forced to break a window. Because even if it's 80 degrees out here and I'm sweating and I'm hot, it's probably like 110 inside of there. We found dog owner Kenzie Boyles at the Elyria police station charged with cruelty to animals and asked her why it all happened. I just cried like for 30 minutes like I'm going to jail for like no like I don't have bond. I can't get out of jail and they're taking my dog when I came back. Boyles explained she left the car and her dog at the Burger King parking lot at three in the morning because the car had a dangerous front rim and she was afraid to drive it any further. And when her boyfriend picked her up, he didn't want to get his new car interior dirty. Boyle says she came back to check on the dog and give it food and water at 7 a.m., but again, she left the dog in the car. A vehicle, as you can see, she later felt she could drive safely to the Elyria police station. But your dog was there, it was noon, it was almost 80 degrees. That's not right, right? Yeah, I mean, I definitely don't agree. I had the windows down. I mean, they can see it in the video. I came back, I fed her. I think she should get charged. She should face some jail time or a serious fine and get her dog taken away because that's unacceptable. And Boyle's set for an arraignment in this case tomorrow afternoon at Elyria Municipal Court. Reporting here in Elyria, I'm Five on Your Side investigator Joe Paganakis.